everyone welcome back to another video if this is your first time here welcome to all things burn i appreciate you clicking on this video and checking this channel out if you are a current subscriber thank you so much for coming back by and checking out this video i hope you all are doing well i hope your families are doing well and i hope you're living your best blessed life you all yo i have an exciting Dollar Tree haul for y'all today. Oh, I couldn't believe some of the things I found at the Dollar Tree, y'all. They are just amazing. So get a pen, get a piece of paper, jot down what you think you might want to find at your local Dollar Tree. Go get you something to drink. I'm drinking my strawberry lemonade. Um, the little singles that you shake into water by the Weiler brand, I believe it is. So good. And my little watermelon cup from the Dollar Tree, y'all. I love that little cup. Like, I use that cup every day, y'all. Like, every day I use that cup. And if you have not yet subscribed, I would love to have you as a subby friend. I would love for you to subscribe to this channel. It's absolutely free. And you can hit the notification bell and you'll be notified every time I upload a new video. And also go over to Instagram and follow me on Instagram at All Things Burn. I would love to have you over there and I will follow you back. And I just appreciate all of you all for subscribing and following me on Instagram. So let's get into this Dollar Tree haul, y'all. <sighs> I, just, I just can't believe what I found. Um... And then I'm going to show you guys something from uh, Amazon and Walmart, y'all. There's not a lot of stuff. I think it's three things from Amazon and two things from Walmart. So, but, yep, sit back, relax, enjoy, and let's get into it, y'all. First of all, I got to show y'all this first because when I walked in the door at Dollar Tree, first of all, let me just tell y'all this. I was in Dollar Tree on Thursday. Today's Saturday, uh, April the 13th. You guys will probably see this on, um, I might upload this tomorrow. It's possible I might upload this tomorrow, Sunday. If not, you'll see it on Monday. So happy Saturday, happy Sunday, happy Monday. <laughs> but y'all, let me just tell y'all, I went to the Dollar Tree on Thursday after my physical therapy appointment, right? It was, it was, uh, it wasn't storming when I went to physical therapy, but when I came out, it started storming. So I was a little bit hungry when I came out. So I was like, and Zaxby's is like right up the road. So I went to Zaxby, ordered me a kid's meal, which I always do online. And I just go through the drive-thru and pick it up. So it's, um, you get two tenders, some fries and a drink. And you get this, these little graham crackers. I never eat those, but. So I picked that up and then I was going to eat it in the parking lot of Zaxby's. But then I said, no, because Dollar Tree was like right around the corner. So I went to Dollar Tree first. I said, you know what? I like to eat my food as soon as they give it to me because it's hot, you know, and it tastes better. But I didn't do that. I left it on my front seat and I said, let me run into Dollar Tree because I was looking for uh, the leaves, you guys. I still haven't found them. So I went in there. Of course, I go down every aisle. So y'all, I saw this big crowd at the front of the store. And I was like, what is going on over there? And it just so happens that the bread man had just walked in and was loading up those um, stands with bread and snacks and donuts and cakes and all kind of stuff. And it must have been like 20 people over there, y'all. I couldn't even get to the front to like grab some stuff. So this lady was like, you want me to grab that for you? I was like, yes, please. You want me to grab that for you? I was like, yes, please. And so my cart was full. I, I pop up a picture and I might even put up a little video if I don't put it up on um, a short first. But um, so y'all, it started pouring raining. Uh, we had a tornado in the state of Florida. I forgot exactly where, not by me, but it was storming, like buckets was coming down. 
And so all of a sudden, I guess somebody had an accident and they hit the transformer and the power went out in the whole shopping plaza. So we were standing there, all of us getting ready to pay for our stuff. All of our carts were full because the bread man had came and we couldn't pay for it. So the manager was like, I need everybody to come to the front of the store. As you see, the power is out. We don't have any registers and you know, blah, 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 blah. So she's like, let's wait a few minutes because usually it comes right back on, but it didn't. So she was like, well, you guys, I'm gonna have, have to have you guys leave the store because um, I called the power company and they said they don't know when it's gonna be, when it's gonna come back. She said it could be an hour, it could be a couple of hours. So I was like, oh Lord. And I really wanted my stuff too. So I said, you know what? A few of us, well, first of all, she said, just leave your buck, buddy, uh, your buggies up here and I'll put them all in a row on the side. But I tore off a piece of paper and wrote my name on it and put it in my cart. And I got one of the lays and I wrapped it around the poles. <laughs> so I make sure I remember which buggy was mine. So um, I went back out in the parking lot, sat in my car. A few of us sat in our cars. And I said, oh, perfect time for me to eat my Zaxby's. <laughs> so I was just eating my Zaxby's. And it was pouring, like scary pouring. And I was like, oh, my Lord. I don't know. And now 30 minutes had passed already. And I was like, it was two o'clock. I was like, man, I still gotta go to Walmart. I was like, Lord, I don't I don't want to sit here for no two hours just to, you know, just to purchase my stuff that I have in a Dollar Tree. So I'm gonna tell y'all what. I learned a valuable lesson about patience while sitting in that parking lot. Sometimes we're waiting on God to do stuff and we want it done like that. But no, he makes us wait because there's a lesson in waiting. You know, he's trying to teach us something. And so I waited. I waited 30 minutes. I waited 45 minutes. And I was like, I saw people drive off. And it was me and this other car was still just sitting there in our cars waiting. And so I'm, I promise you, y'all, I looked at that store. And I said, Lord, in the name of Jesus, I command those lights to come back on in Jesus name. As soon as I said in Jesus name, blink, the lights came up. Don't y'all know there's power in the name of Jesus? Y'all need to start using his name more in the name of Jesus. Yes, that's a little, that's a practical thing, but we have power in our tongue. And there's power in the name of Jesus. So the lights came back on. So I was like, oh my Lord. I was like, thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. I could go in the store. So it was pouring too, too hard. So I didn't get out. I waited like maybe five more minutes. And then the rain, you know, started slacking off. And I had my umbrella, I had my jacket, I had a hood on. I mean, it was pouring, y'all. And so I saw two people go up to the door and they pulled on the door and the store still wasn't open. So I got out, I walked up there and I was like, hmm, I wonder why the store is not open, I like to on. And so the manager came out and she said, yes, we have power, but our registers are still not up and running. So give us a few minutes and we'll see if we can get them up and running. So we just stood outside the door talking, you know, about just different things, Dollar Tree, life. And there was this gentleman and he told me and this lady, y'all know I be having stories for y'all, right? Y'all know I be having stories. If y'all don't want to hear the stories, just fast forward to the hall. But um, there was this older gentleman, Caucasian gentleman, um, very nice man. And we was just talking and he said, I have, he said, I make crosses. He said, I had like 28 of them the other day and I only have two left. And he said, I feel led to give both of you all one. And uh, the first lady said, she said, oh, she took hers first. And I, I just had what was left. And, oh, man, I should have brought it out here, y'all. I'll put a picture of it up there. And I said, oh, thank you, sir. He said, I don't know what it is about your conversation, but I just feel like you're a Christian and that you, that you believe in the Lord Jesus Christ. And I was like, okay, I better let my light shine. <laughs> 
But anyway, it was really, really small. But uh, I think I'm going to put it on my keychain. But it was so nice of him to just give us two a cross. And then he was asking us, is there another Dollar Tree around here that sells the bread? And we was like, I was like, well, there is another Dollar Tree on Wakaiva Springs Road in um, Hiawassee and Wakaiva Springs Road. And I said, but they don't sell the bread like they have the bread for one twenty five. I said, their bread is like $3 and up. And I said, but it's fresh. Like, it's like grocery store bread. You know, when you go to the grocery store. But it's just a little bit cheaper than a grocery store. So, and then the lady, she was like, oh, well, I always know when the bread guy is here because I follow him on Facebook. I was like, really? She was like, yeah. She pulled him up. She said, take his pic, uh, take a screenshot or just take a picture of him with your camera. And I did. And I start, I'm following him now. She said, because he always lets you know exactly when he's going to be here in, in the Apopka store, the Oviedo store on uh, Colonial, like all over, all over Central Florida. And I was like, oh, so that was the reason for the crowd. She said, yeah, because all of those people follow him. So they know when he's going to be here. I was like, oh, my gosh. But I was happy she told me that. And um, he was there today, today Saturday. Um, I looked on Facebook and it said estimate time of arrival, 12 p.m. But I already got enough, so I didn't go. So, but that was my experience on Thursday, y'all. But let's get into this Dollar Tree haul, y'all. So, like I said, when I walked in the store, this was sitting at the front. And I was like, I know that's not a dollar and 25 cents. That got to be like probably three or five dollars so I asked one of the ladies that was working there I was like excuse me ma'am is this the dollar 25 she said yes ma'am it is I was like for real she said yes ma'am I said okay all right I said I don't know about these flavors especially this one I said the second one the one in the green bag I, I can deal with but I don't know about this one but we're gonna buy because it it's 125 y'all it is the signature flavors by Kingsford. It says new and they are, um, it says flavor boosters with cumin chili and mesquite wood. And it says easy to add to any charcoal grill. And it is two pounds, y'all. Two pounds. I was like, what? Y'all know it's springtime? Well, we can grill year round down here in Florida, but springtime, summertime is coming, y'all cumin chili i don't know how that's gonna taste but i'm i'm I, i'm I, i'm trying to think of the word i'm trying to use i am curious to see how this is going to taste on my you know on the stuff that i'm grilling so we'll see but y'all better run to y'all dollar tree and see if they have these and then now this is the one i was like okay i can go with this one this one is basil sage and thyme and it says and oak wood um y'all look at this i can't believe it that it's 125 i can't believe that it's 125 it's heavy like I said, it's two pounds and one twenty-five, and they had loads of it at my store. Like it was the first thing you saw when you walked in. So I have to pick up one of each. Then a lot of the stuff I have is brand new, y'all. Some of it is repeat buys, but most of it is brand new. This was new in my Dollar Tree. This is the Guru Nanda. Uh, sinus rinse. Ooh, I almost had an avalanche over here, y'all. Stuff is starting to fall down. Let me fix this stuff right. Let me put this stuff up here. Hopefully, it won't come down no more. Sorry for the noise, y'all. Okay, so, um, like I said, the Guru Nanda Easy Squeeze Sinus Rinse Bottle. Um, yeah, that's all it says. It's just this comfort tip, easy squeeze design, and it's reusable. So, I was like, what? 
So that is what it looks like. You know, this is name brand. I have to look this up and see how much it costs. And then it has the um, two other things right here, which they had that as well. So I got this as well. And let me see. This is the saline pre-mixed packages and you get eight packages in here all natural sinus relief so if you have issues with your sinuses or you can nasal congestion dryness Dollar tree got you boo look at that eight packages eight packages so i got two of those I got two of those, and I got three of the ones I just showed you. One for me, one for my husband, one for my son. I got three of those, y'all. Yes, I did. Yes, I did. So, I got three of those. Then, they had the Guru Nanda Hydrate um, Electrolyte Drink Mix. It says three times electrolytes of traditional sport drinks with vitamins B3, B5, B6, B12, and vitamin C. And then it says natural lemon and lime flavor. And you get only two, um, you, can, you just get two sticks in here. So I thought that was pretty interesting. I'll just keep these in my little crayon box that I have with some other stuff in it that I showed you guys. I'm going to keep that in there just in case I feel dehydrated. Then, this was new as well. You get 50 straws in here. And it's by the Serve brand. And it's um, com compostable with white straws. And you get 50 count. And it says extra strong. So I got that. Really nice. I might, probably should have got two of these, but I think I only got one. Then this was new, some avocado napkins and you get 16. It says, let's be a stock. Probably uh, putting this stuff out for Cinco de Mayo. I'm thinking. So it's just avocado napkins. Really, really cute. So I just got a pack of those. This was new as well. It says Faith will see us through. I had to get that. When I read that, I was like, yes, Lord, it surely will. Because I'm using my faith to see me through right now. Y'all, <clears throat> with this situation with this arm and neck. So, but God is going to see me through. I know he is. Why? Because I put all of my trust in him. All of my trust in him. I might not see it happening, but I know he's working behind the scenes, and I know he's going to do it. Right. This was new. I got this for Braylon. Um, you get 24, what is this? 24 wrap-free crayons. Mm. It says long-lasting coloring. And it was in a, and they're a lot longer. And so, I was like, okay. They're really, really nice. The packaging is really nice. I like really nice. So, and they're by Bic, name brand. Got that for Bray Bray. Um, this is not new, but I don't think it's new. It's not new, but it's it's the newest of um, global beauty care. It's some of the new stuff that's coming in. I, I bought one before, but um, I don't. I didn't get the cleansers. So, um, this is the blemish control oil free, oil free clarifying cleanser, and it's just two point five ounces foaming gel by Global Beauty Care. This is a really really good product, y'all. I mean, <laughs> this is really really good. Especially the blemish control, spot control. That works amazing. It works amazing. I think I was telling you guys before in my Dollar Tree empties, or I told you on one of the hauls that I had got a little pimple over here, somewhere over here. 
And uh, I put that on at night. When I woke up, it was gone. I was like, whoa. <laughs> I was like, okay, that works better than little peel off um, patches. So, and then I got the, um, which one did I just show you? The cleanser. And so I got the blemish control pore clearing scrub. So I wanted, I wanted the whole collection. So I got two of the cleansers and one of the scrubs because they only had one. Yeah, they only had one. So and this is not at every Dollar Tree that I go to. It is not at every Dollar Tree. So, so I, when I see it, I just pick it up. Um, this was new. It's called Retractable Erasers, and you get two. I thought that was interesting. I was like, oh, wow. By Jot. Okay. That is nice. This is great for um, people that are in school, young children, because it's retract retractable. So, I thought that was very interesting. So I got those two. Um, like I said, I have a lot of new, but some stuff is not new. So I'm gonna show you some some stuff that's not new right now, which I always get. Like I would say, just repeat buys, which is my gain. I always get it. I wasn't at Dollar General, so I just picked it up at the Dollar Tree. So make sure these things are tight. My husband and I have going out for dinner today, y'all. I don't know where we're going yet, but we're going out for dinner. Gain. Nothing fancy, just one of our local spots around here. Um, this one is Odor Defense, and you get 15 sheets. So, I got that. And I always pick these up. These are the Diamond Cosmetics, but it's the Wide Board Grinder. Um, nail file. So I always pick this up. Always. And this this one right here is really good to take off gel nail polish. It works really well. I love I love it. Um pick this up for Mr. Brayman. This big old bottle of bubbles. It says outdoor fun because I bought him a few things. That requires bubbles so when he's when he comes here in June we'll be ready because the last time I think we ran out of bubbles and the Dollar Tree was closed and we didn't have any more bubbles so I was like Braylon we don't have no more bubbles he was like <laughs> oh that's so funny y'all and then Dollar Tree has these glasses coming out they always have these but I guess they have some new colors. I just got the green one. They have blue, green, purple. I want to say I put it on my Instagram already. The colors that they had. But I just got the green one. I thought the green one was really nice. Then, oh, let me get me something to drink, y'all. Ooh, let me get something to drink. Mm. That's strawberry. I haven't even tasted the lemonade yet, y'all. I just been hooked to the strawberry lemonade. Okay. All right, let me go down here first. Uh, I saw this bag. Of course, they had multiple bags. Uh, Land of the Free, and it just has stars. And then I sometimes when I read this, I was like, "Are we really free?" But that's another question for another day and another whole video, y'all. <laughs> Land of the free. But for the most part, we are. We are. I'm free in Jesus. That I do know. So, land of the free. So, pick that up. They had a lot of different styles, but I only wanted that one. I only wanted that one. And then, the $5 section, which I always say, I'm not, I'm not buying nothing in the $5 section. I always say that. And then I go over there, and I'm like, well... I had this lady laughing that was um, waiting on the bread, um, waiting on the bread guy to fill up the stands. And I said, I only came here to look for like three things. And I said, but I went down every single aisle. And I said, she's like, the plus section is really nice, isn't it? I was like, I don't know how much I like the plus section. I said, although I got two things from the plus section. She said, see, see. 
Oh, but anyway, I thought this was a really nice. This is a memory foam bath mat. And it's, it was $5. It's black. The one I got from Timu is only this size. But it only cost me $0.98. Cents. But it, it's really nice, though. But it's small. But this one is twice the size, y'all. Look at that. So, I got this for my shower area in my bathroom. So, got this. Um, of course, that was $5. And then, let me put this back like that. And then, I picked this up. This was $5 as well. This is a 6 cube storage rack, y'all. It was $5. Look at that. $5. And Dollar Tree already sells these. So, I didn't get the cubes yet because I'm not sure what color I want in here. But I just went ahead and got this since it was $5, y'all. And it's kind of heavy. I don't know how strong it's going to be. Um... And I was going to, I thought about using it for Braylon's toys, but I have bought that three stack thing. I forgot what it's called. Three stack tray, I think. Basket. Three stack basket. It was baskets, but you can stack them. And I bought three of them. So I don't know if I'm going to use that for his toys or this for his toys. I feel like if I use this for his toys, I can kind of hide them, you know, inside these things. So we'll see. But not bad for five dollars. I'm looking for something else, and uh, whenever I find it, I will let you guys know and show you guys what it is. Okay, so y'all, Dollar Tree has luxury home pillowcases, and it's two pillowcases for a dollar and twenty-five cents. They only had gray, and they only had white. This is the gray one. And I was not going to get the white one, but I said, you know what? No, let me get the white ones too. So I want to open these because I want to see. Last time they something like this came through um the Dollar Tree. You got a surprise. Like you opened it up and it was a picture of something on it. I was like, whoa. But this, oh my goodness. Okay, it's two pillowcases, 20 by 30 inches. But y'all, when I tell y'all, these things for like cotton balls, they so soft. Oh my God, I'm gonna have to go back and get some more. I am gonna have to go back and get some more. They feel like hotel quality, y'all. Or like a nice hotel. I'm not talking about a cheap hotel. Yeah. Hold on a second, you guys. I want to make sure this is clear. Okay. I just want to make sure that um, that glass was clean. Um, the camera area was clean. So, here they go. These are long. But let's see. Do they have any surprises? Okay. Now, I was watching Thrifty Tiffany's um, Dollar Tree haul. And I'll link her channel uh, in the uh, description box below. Now, hers had lace on it. But these have like a satin trim. Really nice, y'all. Look at that. Let's see if I can get it close. Look at that. Really, really nice. Oh, my goodness. And these are like, I don't know if these are king size or standard. I would have to measure it and let you guys know. Because 20 by 30, um, I want to say it's king size, but I'm not sure. I just know they are nice. Oh, my Lord. These are really nice. I see why they say luxury, because they are, they are, they really are. And I usually like to bring my own pillowcase. If I don't bring my own pillowcase, I'll buy a towel or bring a towel and put it over the pillowcase. If I stay at some hotel or even on a cruise ship. Wow. 
That's nice. I'm going to open up these gray ones and see if they have a design on them. And put this back. I'll put it back. Okay, here we go. <clears throat> these are gray ones, so let me see. Let me hurry up to it. I'm almost done though, y'all. Okay. See, wait, is this just one? Because it says two. See what I mean, y'all? I thought it was gray, but it's not gray. Look at that. Red, dark gray, light gray, like different shades of gray. And these look a lot shorter. These are, oh, but they say 20 to, to 30 as well. But they look a lot shorter than the white ones. But y'all better check the Dollar Tree and check out the luxury pillowcases because these are really, really nice. For a dollar and 25 cents. Yes, ma'am. Yes, please. I'll take it. Now, I couldn't wait to show y'all this. This, this is the reason why I waited in the parking lot for my buggy. Because I was like, oh, I have to get those things. This was new, y'all. Packing cubes. And you get two to a pack. And it's by Closet Essentials. Great for traveling. What? Y'all, I bought three. One for my husband, one for myself, and one for one for my son. Yeah. But I'm gonna open it up. Um, here's the SKU number in case you are looking for it online. Take a screenshot of that. But those are the measurements. Those are the measurements. I could not believe it. I was like, what? Okay. We gotta open this up. I'm telling you, Dollar Tree never ceases to amaze me. Okay. Okay, are they the same size? So they're not the same size. You have a smaller one and you have a bigger one. So you have a smaller one and a bigger one. So let's see how big. Let's see, the smaller one they say is six. 0.75 inches by 11.5 inches. So let me see. Is there a zipper? How do we get into this thing? Oh, okay. I was like, how do we get into this thing? Okay. Where is the zipper? Where is the beginning of the zipper? Is what I'm looking for. What? Wait a minute. Oh, here it is. I was like, wait a minute now. Okay. Okay, I just closed it. Now I open it. Make sure the zipper works. Okay. Okay, not bad. I like this part so you can see what is in your bag. And um, you can fit uh, quite a few things in here. They have... Okay, so they have like lotions and stuff like that in the little one. See, in the little one, they have lotions. And then the other one, they have like some probably undergarments or maybe even t-shirts. So, interesting, interesting. Now the big one, let's see the big one. Oh, this is perfect for Everybody might be going on vacation now. The summer is coming. Um, so, yeah, people are going on vacation. Wow, this is really nice. This is really nice. Oh, yeah, you can get quite a bit of uh, undergarments, T-shirts, socks. Wow. Okay. So, it's about that high. But, yeah. Pretty big on the inside, y'all. Look at that. Um, 
and then you can always see what you have in there. And then it has this little hook so you can carry them. So you can carry them. I love it. Oh, I'm so, I'm so glad I waited. You see, another lesson I learned while sitting in my car, patiently waiting for Dollar Tree to open back up. Good things come to those that wait. Y'all, I can find a message in anything, just about something spiritual. It always resonates with myself. And maybe it'll resonate with you. I don't know. These were new in my Dollar Tree pink baking pans. I got two of them. I got two of them. I love it. I love it. I'm making a big dinner tomorrow. I'm making ribs, barbecue chicken, macaroni and cheese, collard greens, cornbread, deviled eggs, yams, banana bread. <laughs> yeah, and I'm making fresh collard greens. I'm not using my Margaret Home ones. I just had a taste for some fresh ones, y'all. Okay, let me get some the rest of this stuff out and I'll be right back, you guys. Okay, y'all. This was new as well. It says unwind. Like Dollar Tree is really coming through with these signs, y'all. These things look like they should be in Hobby Lobby. Like a dollar twenty-five for real? Wow. Patio. Yes, I have another one that said enjoy. So we're gonna enjoy, we're gonna unwind. Yep, that's what we're gonna do. <laughs> and I just bought some cushions that are blue and white. So Yes, please. Pick that one up. Pick this one up. Life is good. I love this one. Life is good, so relax. Life is good, so just relax. Just relax. I love it. I love Dollar Tree's uh, signs. I have two of those. I have two of those. Um... This one I really, really, really like. This one just says welcome with all of the, what a seahorse and then some seashells. Really pretty. I think I'm gonna put this one in the living room by the fireplace. It says welcome, come on in. Welcome in, welcome in. I have two of those. Yep, I have two of those. And it just says decor on it, so. Let me move this out the way. And then this one looks like it costs about five, seven, or eight dollars. It says porch rules. Sip on some sweet tea. Um, take a long nap. Gather with family. Tell stories. Relax and unwind. Laugh together and watch the sunset. Yes, this is going on the patio. Love it. Love it love it and it is really hard and and a and lot heavier than their normal signs so I absolutely love it love it love it love it love it love it okay these were new this is by sure fresh you get 20 in the small ones and 15 in the big ones and they are the air fryer parchment Paper liners. I was like, Dollar Tree got this for real. So that is the small one with 20. I love using these. I got mine from um, Timu. I think I had got 50 in a pack for like $1.99. So Timu was still cheaper than Dollar Tree. But uh, because they were there and it was something new, I was like, yeah, I can never have too many of these. And um, this is the larger one. You get 15. So, come through Dollar Tree. Come through Dollar Tree. Let me switch this. That on the inside. Now, this is the cake that I always get from the Dollar Tree to make my um, pistachio cake. But I went to Walmart and Walmart sells um, zero sugar or sugar-free cake mix. So, I'm going to try to make it with that. And they also have the sugar-free um, pistachio instant pudding mix. So 
I'm gonna try and make a sugar-free one and see how that comes out. But this is, I always get this one. And it always comes out perfecto. I got me some more Hungry Jack pancake mix. Complete. And it says just add water. These are good. I always make these all the time. I got my Margaret Holmes, but I'm not going to be using these tomorrow. These are just to keep, just in case. Put in my pantry, just in case. I have a taste for some collard greens, and I don't want to have to clean them like I'm going to have to do today. This was new. If I have time, I might taste these on camera. These are the uh, Hershey Kishes. Kishes. The Hershey Hershey Kisses. <laughs> Rainbow brownie that is new and it must be really good because this was the only pack sitting on the shelf So I just got that so let me leave that right there in case just in case I picked up two knives two packs of knives because I had the forks and the spoons But I had not seen the knives. So now I got the knives as well I've already thrown away all the ones that I didn't want and replaced them already and they're working out well I've already put them in a dishwasher they didn't rust or anything like that, so I'm happy with it, y'all. I am happy with it. I love this hair clip. It's just, it's black, but it's beautiful. I'm like, I was not thinking about just a hair clip. I was thinking about putting it on a shirt and clipping it, y'all. Like I said, I'm always thinking of box at Dollar Tree, but this is really pretty for your hair, too, though. And it has that little clip right there. So, I, it could be worn either way. Um, I picked up these foam hair rollers. I'm going to do a DIY with this, and I'm going to show you guys what it is when I find the rest of the items that I need for it. Because I haven't seen it in Dollar Tree lately. Okay. Oops. Darnell is back in the Dollar Tree, y'all. So, I got me a package of Darnell cups you get 12 cups i love these cups love these cups whenever i find them i buy them because they are really good like really good um they had some of the men's um bath sponges so i got these for my husband and my son because my husband loves his the one i bought him before he was like you have any more of those black um loofahs or bath sponges i was like nope and i can't find them at the Dollar Tree, but they had a whole box full, so I got him some more of those. And this was also new. You get 24 of the Serve Compostable White Cutlery. So I thought that was interesting too. Might even use these tomorrow. I don't even know, but I might. Nobody's coming over for dinner um, because my daughter and my son-in-law are in Jamaica. They left yesterday. They made it safely, thank God. They made it safely, thank God. And so my daughter just called me. They're shopping. She was like, Ma, you want this hat? You want this? You want this? I was like, yes, 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 yes. <laughs> it was funny, y'all. It was funny. Because they, they have a house in Jamaica, so they always go down there and check on their house. Um... This was new. This is called Pink Diamonds Body Lotion. I was like, okay. I've never seen this in Dollar Tree before. Um, let me see what it smells like. Let me see, what is this? This smells like something, not Jergens. What does this? It smells good, y'all. But it smells like a dupe for something. Is it white diamonds? It smells good, y'all. It smells really, really good. Wow. So I just picked that up. And then they had the next generation coconut oil hemp seed body lotion. It smells so good, especially this one. This one is the sweet pineapple and honeydew melon. Y'all, if y'all can find this one, pick it up. You will not be disappointed. And the body wash, I'm using it now. I love it, y'all. I love it. So, 
Let me put it right here so you guys can actually see. Coconut oil, hemp seed, body lotion, 12 fluid ounces, and then this one, sweet pineapple and honeydew melon. When I tell y'all this one is off the chain, this one off the chain. Then they have some new, um, what are they calling these? Air freshen and solid gels. So pretty. Like the containers are so pretty. But I'll show you the one by one. Um, does it say which one, what scent this is? It, let me see. I can't read that. Put my glasses on, y'all. Wrong glasses. <laughs> I put my glasses on because I can't read that. Let me see. So small. What does it say? Genevieve. I think that's what it says. Genevieve. But that's what it is. It's by Chant. By Chant or Chante. It could be either one. So anyway, I got that. I got this one that says Edition 7. Got that one. That's the top. So pretty. So pretty. And then I got this one. It's called Lila. And this one is pink. The packaging is just everything, y'all. It is just everything. Look at the packaging. So pretty. Okay, I only have one more item from the Dollar Tree. And then we're going to Walmart. I got my cups, y'all. Oh no, I have one other. I have this one too. Um, this is volume volumizing dry shampoo, but it's watermelon. And it's by Be Pure, but it's watermelon scented. So I just picked that up. I don't necessarily use this on my hair. I could put this on like a wig or a ponytail. That's what I got this for. Yeah. Let me just put it right here so you guys can see. That's the reason why I got that. So, yep. That um, sure living line. Like what? Amazing. Now these have the blue straws. Blue straws. I may keep the blue straws and the blue glasses since the glasses are blue. So, but these are so nice. Let me turn it like this so you can see. Sure living. Absolutely gorgeous. And you know, these things were going fast. I think these were only two on the shelf. So I grabbed the last two. And then I want to say I have four of these. It could be in another haul coming. So if I show them to you again, just know I have, I think I had four, but I might only have bought two, but I don't know. I thought for sure I bought, I bought two and then I was like, oh, let me get two more. But I don't know, I have to see. And then I got the clear ones. I got the clear ones. I didn't particularly care for the blue straw in the clear ones. So does it say how many ounces it is? No. Doesn't say how many ounces, but these, what? These are so nice, y'all. These are so nice. Yes, you can order them from, you can order a set from Amazon or you can order a set from Timu, but you're going to pay. Even on Timu, Timu you're going to pay for a set. Maybe like 10 bucks for a set. So I got, I think, well, I have four because I have the two clear and the two blue, but I think I have two more of these. And didn't even pay $10 for all six glasses. So, I didn't want those straw, straws. So, I ordered me some straws from Amazon, y'all. And um, I was like, yeah. I, and I may change those out, but I don't think so. I, I like the blue straws with the blue glass. Like, I like that. But we'll see. So, I ordered some straws from Amazon. I think it was $6.99. I might have been able to get them a little cheaper on Timu, but it would have took too long time. So, um, let's see, why is this not coming out? Why is this not coming out? It came in a box like this. 
And so I'm just trying to slide it out. If it wants, it doesn't want to slide out though. I may have to just rip the whole box, it looks like. Why isn't it coming out? Oh, I guess it's not going to come out. Wait. This is stuck. Okay. So, I got, I forgot what, how many straws this is. Is it 12? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. No, it's 16 straws, y'all, for $6.99. And it came with the cleaners and everything. So I'm just going to show them to you all. So, because I'm going to replace my straws in these glasses. So let me just, let me just replace one and see how it's going to look. Because, you know, it has the blue straw right now. And I just hope they fit. I just hope they fit. I just hope they fit. Oh, they fit. They fit. They fit. See, y'all? I just took it from ordinary to classy with my little glass straw, y'all. Oh, I'm so excited. I hope I have I hope I have my other two cups, y'all. I hope I have my other two cups. So, and this is the one that has goes on an angle. I Love it. Oh, I love it. I love it. Um, let me put that back. And so, wow. And then I have the regular straight ones. And then I have the shorter ones for shorter glasses. Amazing. And then the four brushes. So nice. I, I was like, that's pretty good for... Um, for $6.99. Yeah, I'm gonna get that. So, and it came in two days, y'all. It came in two days, because I have Prime, so. Okay, let me put that away. Let me put that away. The other thing I got from Amazon I wanted to share it with you guys was I was telling you guys about some body butter, right? So, um, it says, it's by Ashanti. It's actually by Ashanti. And um, I'll put the links for these and the links for the straws as well. But it says Bouffants and Broken Hearts by Ashanti. Oh my good, goodness, I need my glasses again, y'all. Oh, these words are so tiny. No, this one says by Kendra, Kendra Dandy. But if you go on the website, it says Ashanti. So... Yeah, I don't know. It says Ashanti on the website, but when you get the package, it says Buffon and Broken Hearts by Kendra Dandy. So, but y'all, when I tell y'all, this is the best body butter I ever tried in my life. This one is the Juicy Peach. And this one is the Pink Kisses. I only opened the pink kisses just to try it out. I like it. It's, it has a very faint smell. So I dug in it a little bit. But uh, let me see. I dug in it a little bit. As you see the consistency of it. But this peach one. I'm, I'm about to order another peach one, y'all. This peach one is a amazing i have really been in that one y'all <laughs> i have really been in that one but uh oh my goodness this is some good stuff oh my goodness oh my gosh if you like peach you will love this you will love this these are 14.99 though they're a little pricey but they are worth the money they are worth the money they have a couple of more scents they have one that says amber something. I think I'm going to get that one too. I definitely want to try that amber one. I'll leave this over here. And um, yeah, so I'll, I'll link those things in the description box below. Let me just show you this little Walmart. Hi, y'all. I got another cup, y'all. It was $3. It was 
this. But look, it was this one. Oh, it's so pretty. I just cleaned out my cup closet yesterday. I had three bags full of cups. Yeah. So, I was like, well, I don't use this one. 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 <laughs> so, now I have a space for my cups. Yeah. I love this pattern. Oh, I love this pattern. And it was $3, y'all. And then they just have some plates. I want to replace the ones I have. Because I like these little um, plastic plates. But they had some really pretty ones. They were 50 cents. I got these. I love the little pattern on it. It almost looks like the, the old style paper plates. With that pattern. So I have this. I mean, I have these two, and I have these two really fun colors, orange, and I have these two really nice. So, but that was it, y'all. Well, let me taste this right quick, because I said I was going to taste this for y'all. Let me taste this right quick. Let me hurry up. Oh, this one's so smashed. Let me see. Okay, here we go. Oh, it's, I like the wrapping. It's cute. Let's taste this right quick. Mm. I don't know, y'all. Let's see. Ooh, I love me some Hershey Kisses, but if it tastes like a real brownie, I'm, I would be on the hunt for some more. Mmm. 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 This is good. Mmm. I don't know if that's rainbows on the inside. Yeah, I think so. It looks like it tastes something a little hard and crunchy. But it's the rainbows. It does taste like a brownie, though. It does taste like a brownie. Mmm. So, those are good. Go try those. So, you guys, thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate you all uh, taking the time out of your morning, afternoon, evening, whatever time it is that you're watching this video. I just appreciate you. Go be kind to someone. Continue to live your, look at my shirt, y'all. Continue to live your best, blessed life. And I will see you in my next video. Bye, y'all.